Hi, this is Jonathan. Um, in this video, we're gonna talk about five excuses for another new guitar. Disclaimer, I don't want to get between you and your other half, and you know, whether it be a husband or a wife. Um, I'm really fortunate and blessed to have a, a wife who understands me totally because she knew what she was getting into when she married me because I was a musician. I'm still a musician. So she knows that you know, um, guitars are part of my trade craft. And, but there are times when I do get overboard, um, when I bought a guitar that I don't really need. So those were the times when I had to come up with all sorts of excuses. But mind you, my profession is different from yours, you know. So some of you uh, might have other jobs and you are probably avid collectors and uh, well, I guess most of you would have really understanding wives. But we're just going to discuss a little bit of what excuses to give to our other half whenever we come or chance upon a brand new guitar that we just feel like we're going to get, you know. So let's start. Excuse number one. It's for my well-being, darling. I, I, I need to have this guitar because I've been dreaming about it. <laughs> I've been losing sleep over it. Couldn't eat, couldn't even drink properly because I keep on having this guitar on my mind. And it's affecting my work. You know, it's affecting my driving sometimes because all I see is this beautiful guitar that's hanging in that shop. I just need to get it. So, darling, please, I need to have that guitar because it's for my well-being. <laughs> All right. Excuse number two. It's for your well-being, darling. Because, you know, I'll be bugging you every day and night about this guitar. And, and I just need to have it. And I'll be bugging you every day. I'll be like asking you, please, darling, could I, could I just go and buy this guitar? You know, I need this guitar. And... It's, it's better for you if you just relent and just let me have it. 
Excuse number three, it's a rare find. Well, you know, darling, that, that guitar is like one in a thousand. No, make it one in a hundred thousand. And it's so rare. And when I play it, you know, it's, it's just me. It's just like when I first met you and I knew you were for me. And this one, this one was spoke to me like how you spoke to me on the night we first dated. And I, I just I just got this feeling, darling, that I need to have it. I need to have this guitar. It's a rare find. <laughs> Excuse number four. You know what? This guitar, if I buy it now, darling, I, if I buy it now, I'm going to make a profit when I sell it. Definitely going to make a profit. Do keep a straight face, you know. Do keep a business orientated or a business-like face. You know, when I buy this guitar, I know I'm getting into because I'm going to sell it for a profit. <laughs> Excuse number five. Now, this only works when you have children, right? And if you if you chance upon a guitar, you really like. Excuse number five is, darling, it's an heirloom. I'm gonna pass it down to the kids. You know, this guitar is gonna probably stay with me for a couple of decades, and then when I'm gone, that guitar is for the kids. Keep a straight face about it. A little bit sad, you know, and just put it bluntly to her. It's an heirloom. I'm gonna pass it down to my children's children, to my grandchildren, and when they play that guitar, they will think of their granddaddy, me. <laughs> right so like I said this is a disclaimer because I don't want to get between you and your other half this this video is just purely for fun and I'm sure a lot of you guys will have wonderful spouses who totally understand um, what you're getting into now I have a couple of guys uh, friends who don't drink who don't smoke who don't go clubbing who don't have any other vices don't even you know don't even drink you know beer or liquor and the only vice or so they thought buying guitars it's buying guitars and i mean if you if you are the wife or the husband of the other half which has no other vices except for buying guitars then you know spare a thought for them but again again another disclaimer if you're not doing financially well you know don't even go there because i believe the welfare of a family is of the utmost importance you know um you know, you know how it is i'm sure you guys are responsible enough to know that you know you don't have to buy another guitar and have your family suffer so I hope you enjoy uh, what I just put forth. And uh, if you're gonna use this, um, <laughs> don't come after me if your wife comes after you with a pot or with a hammer or with other things, you know. So or other utensils in the house, you know. Don't come after me, all right? So I hope you enjoy this video. If you do, give me a thumbs up and uh, join this channel if you want to. And I'll see you again in the next video. So till then, ciao.